Hey, what's up guys? Beat Up coming at you here with another video tonight. I wanted to make a post-stop video for you guys for my GERD corrective surgery. For those of you guys who don't know what I had done. Um, so here we have it. So first and foremost, if you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. My name is Brittany, aka B-Dub, and excuse the um, dishwashing machine there in the background. But anyways guys, I had had um, two weeks ago what is called a Nissen fund application stomach surgery, and it is to correct severe acid reflux along with severe gastroparesis um, where my food never digested properly. So this is kind of what I've, um, what I'm eating for din din. <laughs> I have my power rate zero, oh, excuse me. This has taken me like three hours to drink this much liquid. And then I have clam chowder. And basically what I did with the clam chowder is I had to strain all of the chunks out of it. So it's just a like very runny liquid because all you could have is liquid and no chunks. So this is my dinner. It's like 9.30 at night. Um, definitely not hungry hardly at all after this surgery. As a matter of fact, I'm down almost 16 pounds since surgery. So 16 pounds in 14 days. Um, hence with my clam chowder, I added like a lot of butter and um, milk and just try to make it a little fattening so I could hopefully, you know, gain or just um, maintain or something at this point because I'm losing weight way too quickly, you guys, like way too quickly. Um, my heaviest weight though was 164 pounds. Like when COVID was happening, I was just like stress eating. So I was up to 164. Then I got down to 153 on my own with diet and exercise. And now I'm at 138.8 as of this morning. Um, I do have to go to my oncologist though tomorrow and get my labs drawn. So we'll see where my counts are at for oncology. And then I have to go to the stomach surgeon tomorrow. So I have a lot of questions for her. Um, it's just been very hard to eat, very hard to drink. You get like nauseous um, and you have an urge to burp, like a bunch of pressure right here in your like throat area. It doesn't really go to your stomach, but just like your throat where they did the hernia repair. Um, so that's been really rough, but I keep reminding myself, my esophagus is probably still really swollen, even though I can't see it. And it's still in the process of healing. So I probably have like another five more weeks to go with this. So for those of you guys who are considering this surgery, um, I'll definitely keep you all updated as to how the like long-term recovery has been once I'm fully recovered, like how it, how it is, was it worth it? Was it not worth it? Um, I predict it's going to be worth it because my acid reflux was so severe that they didn't want me getting throat or stomach cancer. So I had to be done. But anyways, guys, um, I hope that you all have a good night. Just wanted to show you my little dinner <laughs> and everything and give you all a quick little update. So until my next video, guys, and you all have a good night. Bye.